Hello everybody, welcome back to another Expeditions Guide. Today we're taking a look at Dehumidification Battle. This is an expedition in the Sonoran Desert. For this expedition you need to have a rangefinder, a hydro monitoring system, as well as a hydrologist on your team. I also have with me the new drone specialist that gives you uh, increased drone speed, so we're going to be giving that a try here. Um, so what we're going to be doing, uh, we're going to be leaving the southwestern outpost all the way down here. Uh, we're going to be following the riverbed until we get to this climb. We're going to climb up and this is where we're going to check out the riverbed. Uh, once we get the riverbed checked out, we're going to go over here to install a rangefinder, over here to install a hydro monitoring system, and then we have an explore the area here and an explore the area over here. That being said, let's get started. I'll show you how it's done. So leaving the outpost over here, mouse out of the way there for you. Uh, we're going to make our way out of the outpost uh, over to the west here. And uh, I am using the AFIM S1960, uh, which gives me the sideboard. I also have um, extra fuel canisters in the sideboard in case we need it, along with um, anchors and jack screws. So we're just going to roll down the hill here. Um, it's This is kind of a sketchy uh, climb down because there's a lot of like really awkward rocks jutting out. But uh, if you just take it nice and easy, you should be able to roll down here without any problems. Just gonna roll all the way down to the bottom here. Once we get down here, we're going to make our way around these two trees. So we want as wide of an angle as we can to get around the trees. And then from here, we're going to stay to the right side as we make our way down this river. And once we get over to these trees, that's when we can jump across the river here. So we're going to head right over here to this uh, crossing point right here. You can pull yourself with the tree if you need to. And then we're going to follow this edge of the river all the way down to where our climb is. So from here, we're just going to climb up this. right on over it right through the water here and between the trees and right here is where we're gonna start our climb so back up get yourself a good angle and start your climb Now this, time, this climb does get a little tricky up towards the top, but there are plenty of trees we can use to kind of pull ourselves up. Um, we're most likely going to need um, a little bit of tree assistance as we get to the top here. Let's make our way up, come up this way. Here's where we're going to use that tree to kind of pull us around this bend. So we can get all the way up here. Go right through these rocks. And all the way up here. And once we get to the top, we're going to head to the right and go around this ridge line by these trees. We're going to go right in between the trees here, climb up these ledges, very carefully we got to climb up the ledges, okay. let's 
kind of a tricky maneuvering spot because you got these other ledges, and if you hit them just wrong, uh, you are falling off this mountain. Extra traction, please. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna put an anchor down. Uh, we're kind of struggling with this, so use that anchor, and that's just gonna pull us right over this final ledge. And we're gonna go check out the riverbed. Seems that we have managed to allocate several places for installing equipment. It is time to get to work. And time to get to work, it is. So we're going to go ahead and get turned around here. Pressure up those tires. We're going to go back along this ridge here. And back through the trees. And we're going to go back down the hill. Back up a little bit to give us a better angle. And down we go. Now getting down this is a lot easier than getting up. Roll right down here. Right on down, and across the river we go. Once we get across the river, we're going to head up over by this dead tree. And that is going to give us a nice spot where we can climb up onto this little plateau. Once we made it up here, we're going to go to the right side here to go around this crack in the ground and make our way over to the rangefinder installation point. We're going to go ahead and install our rangefinder. And then we're going to get turned around and head on back down to the river. All the way down to the river and then we're gonna follow the river just up ahead is going to be our hydro monitoring installation point get that installed and then after that we have some exploration to do we're just gonna stay on the left side of the river here Make our way right through these trees. And right here, we're going to install our hydro monitoring system. All right, with that installed, it is time to do some exploration. So we're just going to travel upriver a little bit more.
here, use these trees. You can see we are now sitting in our exploration area here. So I'm going to start off with binoculars and we're just going to scan the horizon here. That should get us a good chunk of progress done. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to place a waypoint over here and we're going to fly the drone over to that waypoint. Again, I've got the uh, the new drone specialist here that has some extra scouting range and just moves really fast. So we're just going to fly him right over the waypoint here. And that is going to give us that. And then I'm going to put another waypoint right over here. We're going to fly over to this waypoint. You can see how much faster the drone is here. Um, it doesn't have quite the range as the other one, but... There we go. I guess you don't have to do two explore the areas. Interesting. Um, anyway, that's going to be it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed Dehumidification Battle. And uh, we'll uh, see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.